Hello, here I will tell you what is commercial policy. Commercial policy or trade policy is meant all measures regulating the external economic relations of a country, that is, measures taken by a territorial government which has the power of assisting or hindering the exports or imports of goods and services. So, Commercial policy is generally based on the encouragement of exports and discouragement of imports. Now I will tell you what is the objectives of commercial policy. There are some objectives of commercial policy. First is increase in trade. The main objectives of the commercial policy is to increase the trade volume of the country with the foreign nations. Okay. Second is to preserve the raw material. One of the objectives of the trade policy is to preserve the raw material to encourage the development of domestic industries and encouragement of imports. Another object of the commercial policy is to encourage the imports of capital goods for the purpose of economic development of the country. Restrict the imports. One of the objectives of the commercial policy is to restrict the imports so that the unfavorable position of balance of payment may become correct. Import of those things is restricted which are produced within the country. Okay? Stability in exchange rate. Commercial policy is also adopted to achieve the stability in exchange rate. Now, saving in foreign exchange. Another objective of the commercial policy is to save the foreign exchange. Foreign exchange is saved by the restricting the imports. Now, methods of commercial policy. By instrument or methods of commercial policy, we mean those methods which are adopted to achieve the objectives of the commercial policy. And these are tariff. Tariff means the tax levied on the movement of the goods and services out of the country. This may be called as custom duty. Tariff may be transit duty, import duty and export duty. Transit duty is that which is levied on goods of any country which are passing through our country to any other country. Import duty is imposed on the goods brought into the country from the other country. So, export duty is imposed on goods sent out of the country. The objective of a tariff policy is to restrict the import and export of any commodity. Okay, quotas. It means quantitative restrictions imposed on the free flow of the international goods. Imports quota is a fixed quantity of a commodity which may be imported during a specific period. At present, government of many countries are employing the quota system because it is flexible and the home producers know in advance that how much goods are to be imported and how much goods they have to produce. Okay. Export restriction. Restriction on export is also the mean of improving the terms of trade. Export restrictions are flourish when domestic supply and foreign demand are inelastic. Export tax is an effective technique to check the export. Okay. Export restrictions are imposed in order to prevent the loss of goods needed in a country and keep down the price of raw material used in domestic country. Exchange control. Exchange control means the control of government over the exchange of domestic currency with the foreign currencies. Under this system, all receipts from export and other sources are handed over to the currency authorities. Bilateral agreements. By bilateral agreement, we mean that agreement which takes place between two countries for the exchange of goods when more than two countries 
make trade agreement for ensuring fair and equal treatment to the imports and exports of the member countries. There may be water dealings under the bilateral agreements. In the water dealings, agreement is made for exchange of specific commodities at specific rates.